back to my YouTube channel Shazaiwa. If you guys don't know me, my name is Shaza Fatima. Now today I've come with a special recipe and it is known as the seafood dum porata. Now this is a very very special food and it is a trend nowadays and at the same time you may be seeing a lot of videos telling about not seafood but they are using chicken and beef. But maybe I thought that I could show you guys it in seafood style, three variety fishes. So without further ado, let's get started. So all our ingredients are ready over here and I'll be using 1 kg of shrimp, half kg of crabs and 5 pieces of kingfish. So first we'll be making shrimp roast and for that we'll be adding the shrimp into a pan. And after a minute or so you'll find some water that is coming out from the shrimp so just let it dry a little bit in high flame. And after the water is dried, just add 4 onions into it. And then add half teaspoon of turmeric powder, 2 and a half teaspoon of chili powder, 1 teaspoon of pepper and 4 tablespoon of coconut oil and then mix it all together this shrimp roast is very easy you only have to use a few ingredients like onions and few spices and at the same time it's just tasty and then add some curry leaves after that just close it and cook it in low flame and while that's cooking we will be preparing our crab masala and for that add oil and then add ginger, garlic and shallot and then just mix it for few minutes. After that add two onions and then mix it again. And then add salt and then one tomato. And at last, crab. And then add half teaspoon of turmeric powder, one teaspoon of chili powder, two teaspoon of coriander powder, and then at last one cup of water. Just mix it all together and then close it and cook it. And now in between just mix the shrimp roast and then let it cook. Now meanwhile we will be making the fish fry. Now while the fish is frying just add some curry leaves, half teaspoon of garam masala and two tablespoon of oil into the crab masala. And then mix it all together. And let it cook. Meanwhile, we'll be roasting some almonds and cashews. And then after that, some onions as well. And now as you can see, everything is ready. Our shrimp roast, our fish fry and our crab masala as well. After that, place everything into a serving plate. And now we have come to our last and final but the main important part of the Dhamporota. So first of all, you have to add oil into a clay pot and then just spread the oil all over the inside. After that, just place a banana leaf and then add three parottas 
here I'm adding three because of the size of my clay pot and according to yours you can add how much perotta you have to okay after that we'll be adding a shrimp roast just spread it all around and then add the roasted nuts and onions and also coriander leaves now we'll be practicing the same ritual all you have to do is add one parotta and then instead of the shrimp roast we'll be adding the crab masala and then after that we'll be adding the roasted nuts and the onions and also the coriander leaves now again add another parotta and now we'll be adding the rest of the shrimp roast and as usual add the onions and the nuts and also the coriander leaves and then place one more parotta on top of it and then add the fish fries and again you'll be having to add the roasted onions and nuts and also the coriander leaves and then at last just close it with a banana leaf and then just tie it and then in a very low flame place the pot on a pan for 30 minutes our dum parotta is ready and it's really hot right now so let's just open it up Now I'm opening it after an hour of cooling down and now it's just smelling so great. I just can't wait to taste it. Okay guys, so I just tasted it and it is just delicious in simple words. That's all I can say. And like you guys have to try this at home. It's just, I'm just sure, 100% sure you guys are gonna love it. And the other thing is whenever, like when you just open itself, the aroma is just smells good. <laughs> I just love the, the aroma itself and like because of the aroma, I feel like I have to eat this just amazing I am like sure you guys are gonna love it did I just say that already anyhow I hope you guys like this video and if you do please do like share and subscribe to my channel I will be seeing you guys next time and for now bye bye